Arcade Mina Fulcher, welcome to a, another Tony Creates. And look, we're still on this fabric that I love so much. Right, folks. This is inspired by Seven Plaza. Um, I think she said Roxy inspired her. Um, so this is just inspired she was showing a paper clip with fabric on like that like a little piece of fabric like that so you used your paper clip and I was looking and I thought you know what I see there folks I see a belly band now I'm not cutting this one off because I want to use it for a journal and I don't know how long the pages are gonna be because it's a big journal so I'm leaving the fabric on but look at that fabulous belly band and then you can still even take um, a piece of paper if you want and stick it in there so we're just going to decorate this one and then I'm going to show you how I made it so here's what I did folks I uh, I don't measure anything so I just take my paper clip go like this come here and go like that and then we do our rippy rippy there we go we can rip that later to make ruffles okay and then what I normally do you see how this fabric curls over guys what I do is I just take it I take two fingers and I just wrap it around my fingers and then I just uncurls that and just straightens things out <coughs> and at the same time I just all these little loose bits of pieces come out so I just take it like that like that and then those bits can just just relax and there we go so here I've got one um, so this is what I did oops you can come off so you see your paper clip you've got the piece that's short the open bit and then you've got the long bit so what I did is I just first I did the long bit so just put it in like that okay like that this is what I did folks no measuring and then what I did is I took my fabric tack you can take your any glue really um, you can even take a bit of glue stick and just stick it down there but I took my fabric tack and I put it it doesn't really matter for this one so much because it really doesn't have anywhere to go so just kind of wanting to get around not just like around the but not too thick because you don't want your um You don't want it to be showing through sure my English is exhausted right what am I doing now what am I doing now okay I'm doing that I want a little bit of glue stick I'm just gonna take a bit of glue stick just to keep this down let's just go like that and you can just stay down a bit there we go that won't make it hard or anything okay get my page decide I don't want it in the middle I want it there I'm gonna just cut off a piece here okay take the other side doesn't matter I can take this side okay and just do the same it's that simple folks that simple okay like that okay now this one's a bit shorter you see that the the actual thing make sure you get right sides together like you wanted and then just go like that and it make sure they I just kind of make sure that they in line with each other it's not, you don't have to be that 
and that's easy if you just lay your fabric flat you can see where this bit goes and then I'm just gonna try and get some fabric tack all the way around well, not all the way around but you know on at least two sides of that get that back on there get my glue stick go like that and then uh, There we go, pops your uncle, whoops, there we go. Okay, so now I'm gonna go like that. Okay, and then I'm, I'm just gonna give myself a little bit of leeway just in case when I put this down that the page is a bit too, is longer than this one, which it shouldn't be, but you never know people, you never know. Okay, so I got that one. Um, and then this this bit like this um, you can use for tabs on things you can hand make a ruffle on a page you don't need to be sewing on a page oh look at that okay now I want to decorate this and I think um, I think I want to put some buttons on we've got this button that we didn't use on our thing put that down and then where's my other little gold buttons that have been sitting on my desk forever and ever these ones and these different types of gold so I'm just gonna go like that Now you can sew them, but I'm too lazy. I'm too lazy. <coughs> How's that? And then I want to take these are my. Tim Holtz stampy ones. Look at this. On a piece of white cord. How do we like that, folks? Got another white one somewhere. Just a small one. Just want the small one. These are all printed from when I did like chopped up pages, and then you have a little one. Look, these are one that's got nothing on it. There's some white pages with nothing. How come that's white right there? Is that how it's stamped? Or is that how it was made? Should actually get a stamp, but I don't feel like digging around. No, I don't. Ha, huh, here we go. Here we go. This is exactly what I want. Where did you go? Where did you go? Look at that. That's perfecto. Okay. Okay, we're gonna have to do some arranging there. Now it's got a C that's half torn that I'm just gonna go like that. Okay, and I'm gonna put that over there, that there. Too many buttons. Take that down. Take that dot. Right now, I need my mat. I need my mat, people, because this is gonna go through the fabric, and it's going to going to make my desk sticky so let's work away okay I think we need some fingers do we have any yeah let's put a lid on that and let's get our fingers <laughs> okay should we stick this one down first I'm gonna do it this side so we can keep this blue like that. 
that's what I'm gonna do let's use some Fabri-Tac oh, goodness okay let's I need, a, need to clean this this off okay this one is no, we want we want it that way so we want to glue this side oh the brain is fried people fried Okay, sticking down there. This is our button that we filed down. I want to stick him over there. Where's our, this one? hands all sticky sticky over there okay I'm delighted I found this and I'm gonna also I'm gonna just stick this I'm just gonna stick it over the edge like that I love having things stick uh, stick over edges except my person I do not like Uh, hanging over edges or buildings or balconies or things like that cliffs high ladders bungee core bungee jumping no sorry none of that for me I just think life's danger dangerous enough as it is folks why would you want to do things on purpose hmm Okay, now I'm not going to fiddle with that because I'm going to get the glue all over the place. Okay, there's the first one. Let's shift this over. Tick, 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 tick. And I want to do this one. This one is going to go in. You see, this one's loose here. The glue didn't didn't put the glue on properly. But the other one's fine. And that's the one. The, oh, no, it's not. <coughs> anyway, once it's in and it's pulled tight, it shouldn't, it shouldn't come off, please. Okay, so this one's got our... Got our whatchamacallits and I want to get oh look at the these are buttons they were they just they're these plain plain wooden buttons I got in the range and I've just decoupaged them with some Tim Holtz whatchamacallit Tim Holtz so I'm just going to do one and let's get these labels back and like I say this one is I'm not sure how long the page is going to be you see this actually goes narrow here so I'll have to cut it off there but I'm going to leave it on just in just in case you never know if I need that little bit of extra right I want to put this button down here but now I'm looking for my brown cotton now where did I put it I think it's on my other sewing machine hold on a sec think so might be a little bit of a pain when you're styling things in and out of your your uh, belly band but it looks nice it's not like you do it all the time you just have to take care when you slide stuff in there we go Ta -da. and then here's this one should we put that one on let's put that one on let's go like this gonna go like that um, 
I think I'll cut that bit off. And then let's, uh, there we go, vintage photo. Okay. some vintage photo around this one look at those nice coffee stains do it this side woman okay me come get these munchkins down make sure they're down flat Okay, should I put that there? Does it even go? That's on paper. This isn't, this isn't uh, to mold. This is, I want to say, porch prints kit that I got these ovals from. Do an oval and then we need a number folks we need a number okay looks like old Tim's gonna let us down here so then we're gonna have to go find Tracy wait what's this here Freehand. Okay, I think we're going to do it just like that. Let's get some more ink on this side. That's it, folks. We need to put a bit of thread under that as well, hey? But we won't be as aggressive as we were this side. Let's just stuck to the mat but that's okay that's good this is silicone it'll come up so I don't want to disturb it while it's it's doing its thing let's go let's go uh, let's go more conservative like that okay get you up get you all wiggledy piggledy thank you there we go so this side we're gonna stick it like that okay and then we just get you down this side my fabric tech has gone quite um, uh, thick Right guys, there we go. I've got two belly bands. Now I've also got um, There we go. I've also got these paper clips that are much smaller but bigger but a little bit bigger than the average paper clip. So I was wondering where is this piece? I've got this piece of fabric lying. It's also like an off-cut piece, a little thin piece. If I use him, what it would look like. If this is too narrow. I think this might be too narrow. Hey, what do you think? Would it be too narrow for a belly band? Let's go where it's... too narrow probably yeah it's probably bigger to, better to do these these bigger ones this one is a two inch it's a two inch paper clip so and I've only got silver so I'll have to go look out for some gold ones as well but I think the silver looks quite nice isn't that fun guys so I'm gonna maybe do a couple more I'll you do this piece as well so folks I hope you are inspired and start making your own own uh, uh, belly bands from paper clips, paper clip belly band, paper fabric, 
what should I call this paper fabric belly band uh, I don't know what to call it is this dry no it's not look what I did so folks I'm gonna say goodbye and fix up this look at this see the glue wasn't dry now it's let me take this in yeah that's please please oh no now it's all over this i'm taking this off folks i'm taking it off because it's just gonna mess up let's put another one on see i wanted to move it so i could do a nice shot for the end frame but that didn't work, so now I've got to do a repair job. Anyway, folks, I hope you have a great Friday. I will be having lunch in Portugal when you see this. So, uh, I hope you're going to have a great weekend. And I will see you on Monday with the Marguerite Miller Challenge. Cheerio now.